It's the time of year to buy all your friends presents. And if you're like me, a lot of your friends are online and you can't go to their house in person and just hand them presents. So what do you get them? I was stumped for a while too, and I figured out some stuff. I think you might want to check it out. First up, Steam gift card. Pretty simple to get a Steam gift card. Straightforward, especially if they're gamers. Like me, I'm a gamer. Appreciate games. How can you beat that? Now, um, along with the Steam gift card, you can also just go ahead and purchase the game. Get them the game that they want to get. And you think they're going to want. Just buy them the game and send it to them directly on Steam. How simple is that? So easy to do. But remember, when you're buying anything on Steam, you have to be friends with them on Steam to do it. Next on the list, Amazon gift card. Pretty basic again, but gets the job done. Now, Amazon wishlists are a miracle. Because if your friend has an Amazon wishlist, they can send it to you, or they can make one and send it to you, or you can make one and send it to them. They don't need your address, you don't need their address. Just click what you want to buy, buy it for them, you pay for it, just like your own Amazon, except it goes to their house instead of yours. Another idea is if they have like a streamer, a favorite streamer they like to watch, like Stale Moves McGee, you can give them a sub to the streamer. Now, it's a very small gift. This is the one that I think is best because it's so cheap. It costs like five dollars. Five dollars. Another idea. This is this is the pricey one. This one's a little bit more pricey if you get the good stuff. But if you go to Cameo, you can get like celebrities, internet influencers, TV show people, everyone. Like do a personalized message. Personally, me, if I were to do it, I would make a joke about it. I would make some kind of fake note. It'd be like, hey, this guy just got a dog. He's allergic to dogs. I, I don't know. Can't think of anything funny right now. But I would make a joke out of it. That's what I would do. Commissioning art. Now listen. I know what you're thinking. Huh, what do I do? How do I know what to do? It's simple. You can do some searches online. A buddy of mine, Wyatt, actually set up his page where he accepts commissions. He set up his commissions so you can draw a fake mon. Uh, you can draw like superhero characters. These are just like one idea. I'll leave his page in the description below. You gotta check it out. He does great work. I've personally bought it for someone before. I bought it for myself before. It's fun commissioning someone. It benefits the artist and it benefits the person. Come on, it's a win-win. Who loses? No one. No one loses. If you have their address, here's another great one. I think, I thought about this one before. Just go to DoorDash. Order a pie. Order a cake or cupcakes, or cookies, milk, whatever you think. Order it all up for them, send it to their house. Come on, who does love pie? Pie sounds amazing. Um, and last but not least, this I think this is the most simplest one, but it's also the most effective. Just ask for their cash app, their Venmo, their PayPal, their whatever, and just send them money. Just straight up give them money. Everyone's got something, Zell. You don't even need their address for that. You just need their like cash app tag or whatever. Just send them whatever you feel, whatever you can afford. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Thanks for watching, I also, stream on Twitch, uh, I make gaming videos on YouTube, I'm on TikTok, Instagram, all that action. Please like, follow, subscribe, all that good stuff. Always appreciate the good stuff, the good stuff is my good stuff. My good stuff is your good stuff. You know what I look for? I look, you look for it too.